it was stressful to talk about me being the sole operator of this chocolate shop. And so I think it was, it took a while for us to finally get to the point where I, you know, I basically said, you got to be all in with me or I'm not going to do it. I can honestly say, I think that in the 14 years that we've been together and we've lived together for 14 years, this is the closest that we have ever been. And I think a lot of it is, it's not necessarily the the joint talking about the chocolate. I think it's just, we're, we're on the same page. Well, I'm a freelance graphic and web designer. I'm the kind of the graphic designer that you can have come in and just pick up your website and take from where the other designer left off and move forward. I think that's kind of my job as I make things work. Maggie's interest in art and graphic design and her jewelry uh, superseded our desires to enjoy or at least to own or possess the things that a higher income would allow us to possess. It was a, it was a, a decision we made mutually um, based on her interest and her happiness, which is to say, because we're so close, my happiness. Uh, and so we've, we've gone ahead with that. We heard that we looked really out of place for Camden. We had more of a boutique style that you would expect to see in a bigger city and, and not uh, nestled between t-shirt shops and um, gift stores. And we, uh, we took that as a compliment. When, when Chris, my brother, was working at Norman Loves, uh, he knew that what sells uh, are the, well, both the organic, the, the, the natural aspect of the chocolates as well as um, the, the exclusivity of it. Now, what he likes to do is offer a blend of traditional chocolates along with some somewhat unconventional right now. We have the martini and the grapefruit with rosemary. So there's a little bit of something for everyone. Uh, there are a couple of hotels uh, in the area, um, two hotels in particular, the Lord Camden Inn and the Grand Harbor Inn, uh, that are owned by a, a man who has strong community roots and feels, Stuart Smith, feels that because the community uh, matters, he might as well uh, take advantage of our offerings and so he has turned down service uh, at the inns and we provide him with a tray of chocolates. So those chocolates are presented to the guests when they stay at the, uh, the two hotels.